Hello friends, uh, welcome again and this is my new project IT Asset Management System and I have developed this project in Python, Django and MySQL. So Python version I am using Python version 3.7, Django version is 2 and MySQL version is 5.6. For connecting MySQL with Python and Django, I am using the MySQL connector which you will get easily from the MySQL.org website. So this is a web based application, so that's why we have developed the front end in HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also I have used like for form addition, integration of the date calendars and for many more uh, client side operations <coughs> I have used the jQuery plugins. So let's start with the functionality go to what are the features available inside this project and <coughs> what operations it can does. Uh, so the <coughs> project title is asset management system and uh, this is a major project developed in python django and mysql it has admin login only right so where admin can log in and admin can manage the assets right so this is the home page of the project you can see this is the home page this is the static page <coughs> there is nothing dynamic on it right this is about page this is also a static page there is nothing dynamic contact us page these are the static form we are not sending a type of email and sms from this page even we are not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database this is a login from where admin can log in and admin can perform certain operations so once you log inside the system you will get this page right so these are the options which admin can perform right so there is only admin login so you can see this is a head manufacturing company head user ad category ad assets and the same all reports for all of the above modules right so let me go through one by one so these all menu options are available here also you can see in the above header menus right you can see these are the menu options right so this is the ad manufacturing company from here you can add the manufacturing company details right and you can associate this manufacturing company at the time of asset management asset adding form this is the ad user from here you can add the asset uh, users means employee details the ad category from here you can add the category so this is the simple form and from where you can add the category this is also you can you will use this category at the time of asset creation <coughs> this add assets so you can see there are three drop downs here employee company and category and tax right so there are four drop downs here right and this value of four all of the four drop downs are coming from the databases <coughs> right so this you can see these are the some values inside the drop down and these all are coming from the database right? so you can add the asset from here this is a report from here you can see all of the company report you can perform edit and delete operations from here the same user report from here you can edit and delete operations the asset report you can see the assets here right and you can edit and delete the assets here from here also so you can see the all form elements are auto populated this is a category report from where you will be able to perform the CRUD application create read update and delete operations this is a change password the admin can change the password using this form and the logout this is a session driven menu and if you click on the logout the above menu will not be displayed because it's trending according to the session you can see it's not displaying because it's trending according to the session but if you log in the menus are getting changed because the session has set for the admin and it's trending the uh, administration menu right so these all functionalities i have changed uh, in the project it asset management system as I told you earlier, uh, this is a, a web based project developed in Python, Django, and MySQL. So, if you need any extra features, any extra functionality in this project, just put it into the comments. We will incorporate the things. We will make this project more better and better according to your requirements. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest causes. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.